So that pretty much wraps up the buttons that are across the top of the screen. There's also a button to email me. It just takes you to the Canvas inbox, and so you can either click on the inbox or you can click on email your instructor. That's the best way to contact me. I have that email forwarded to a general email so that all email comes into one location. And so the best way to contact any instructor is at the contact information listed on the course syllabus. And when we get to the syllabus, you'll see that I've asked you to contact me via the Canvas inbox. Let's talk about the tabs on the left-hand side of the screen. There's the Home, Announcements, Syllabus, Grades, Chat, and My Success tab. You will not see the one that says Submit Final Grades or any of the ones that have been grayed out. The Home tab is the tab that you land on every time you log into the course. And so when in doubt, if you get lost in the course and you can't find where you were supposed to be, you can hit the Home tab and you can start all over to navigate to where you want to go. The Announcements tab is something that you should click on every single time you log into our class. If I have to send the class an announcement or a message that's important that everyone receive that message, I will send it through the Canvas inbox and I will send out at least one if not two or three messages every week. I've already sent this one out. I sent this out on January 2nd and I just wanted everyone to know that the course was open and because you're a member of the course if you if I send the announcement out everyone in the class gets an email notification you can change where you get that email notification or if you want it to be like a Facebook message or a text message if you modify your profile settings and you can do that by clicking your little account icon in the top left hand corner but because I sent that out everyone in the entire class received a message and then you can either read it via your your email or what I would recommend is click the link in the email that says read this in canvas and then read it in canvas because you'll see that I've set up a bunch of announcements that I want to send throughout the semester just doing random things and so at 8 a.m. on Monday January 7th you will receive this message here and you can see that I've embedded a video and I've kind of formatted things in columns and done different things. In the email, it's not going to look as pretty or be as easy to read. And so my recommendation is get the email, click the link, and then let it launch Canvas and read it through Canvas. So what you should do right now is you should click on the Announcements tab and read any announcements that are currently present. So if you're reading this at 8 a.m. on Monday the 7th, you'll have one or two messages. If you didn't log in until Friday of the first week of the semester, you might have four or five messages because I do send out kind of an obscene amount of messages the first week and a half just to make sure everyone's logged in and has gotten started. After the first 10 days or so, it'll be maybe one message a week and it will be at least one every Monday morning. So the first thing you should do every week is log on, read the announcement for that week that will tell you this is everything you have to do this week in the semester.